Hello and welcome to Artificial Ireland. Yours truly, Polly, 2019, with extra truth of what's going on in Ireland and above and beyond as we put a little show together most days just to wind up the people in Silicon Valley because they like being wound up. Yesterday, 34 degrees at 5.20. Little bit out on the numbers, but the question today is... What did you think it went up to yesterday at quarter past six? And uh, just reading now because we can't get into the comments here now uh, on certain devices because I have to click policies and safety. When you use YouTube, you join a community of people from all over the world. Every cool new community feature on YouTube involves a certain level of trust. Millions of users respect that trust and we trust you to be responsible too. Following the guidelines below helps to keep YouTube fun and enjoyable for everybody. Yeah, you might not like everything you see on YouTube. If you think the content is inappropriate, use the flagging feature to submit it for review by our YouTube staff. Our staff carefully, carefully, oh, we know that, carefully. They should have put that word in brackets or capital letters, but they didn't. Our staff carefully, reviews flagged content 24 hours a day we know that seven days a week to determine whether there's a violation of our community guidelines well thank you very much yt it's a pleasure doing business with you as we move over now to the earthquakes that's banging left right and center in california but of course the uh, usgs decided to downgrade most of the um yeah, that's right, most of the earthquakes. But if you want more information and you want to listen into the professionals, listen into Dutch Sins. Dutch Sins, amazing guy. And it's a pleasure listening to him all about earthquakes because I've learned stuff off him that I would have never learned because the powers to be want you stuck on the platform getting hypnotized all day, not watching these type of videos. Hence, that's the reason why Polly's only getting 70 views. Who else goes out of the way and does all this where we tie in everything like this from Ireland? Is there many other Irish people doing these type of videos? Maybe there is, maybe there's not. Yeah, I know Terry in Wexford likes to explain to everybody about the condensation chemtrails that everybody sees in the air. And uh, you have to go in and type in Terry, Terry, find out who he is. And uh, he's connected to ACI. And you have to do all the research and like Polly, play around with it for a while, work it all out and put it onto a video and let everybody see the truth that's going on. Unless, of course, you want to be hypnotized by the clowns in the uh, mainstream media. And as I said, they like to ram the crap down your throat all the time. So our jobs as independent reporters is to put these little videos up to show everybody that what you're seeing and what you're hearing of mainstream media is the biggest load of crap that you've ever heard in your life. And if you want to go in and listen to real information, I have to recommend, I won't be putting links up, don't do that. Go in and watch Rebel Media from Canada. Rebel Media, their Rebel Media from Canada. And listen to Ezra and all the professional reporters as they let everybody understand what goes on in Canada. Well, Ezra and all the gang in the uh, Rebel Media, we have to say that we're not alone in sharing your responsibilities and headaches, as we in Ireland also have the same. The best thing about Canada being a free-speaking country is that your country doesn't hold all these multinational companies, and they didn't all set up in Canada and set up their European operations from Dublin. Cheap tax, and uh, that's what it's all down to at the end of the day. It, they're not just here because of the Irish people and the leprechauns. Anyway, the beam, the beam, that's right, shine up your smart device up to the sun, and watch the beam, and then dim down, dim down, dim down, and see what you get. This is what you get. So, what causes the beam? What causes the beam? This was yesterday, folks, okay? And as I said, today is the 24th. As I go in and try and read your 
17 comments that came in on the video yesterday and I just can't seem to get into them because of the community guidelines. Now, that's a forced, ladies and gents. That's a forced. And all the other crap that goes with their community guidelines. Yeah. Well, ladies and gents, I'm only a small independent reporter that reports about this crazy thermometer that went up to 38 degrees, ladies and gents, yesterday. 38 degrees is a new record since 2016. It's the first time Polly has ever seen the thermometer going up to 38 degrees. That's it, or whatever you want to call it. Here we go, over the River Liffey. This is one of the cloud systems that comes in, ladies and gents. Just in case you're wondering what does he be talking about when he talks about cloud systems. That's right, there's one cloud system that's coming in from the north, uh, the northwest and came down along the east coast then. So there you go ladies and gents, this is the cloud system that came in on the back of the uh, hot weather that we seen yesterday. In fact, it was probably the maddest day I've ever seen. The heat, everybody was born like a crisp people today are suffering from sunstroke from that one day so ladies and gents when anyone asks where were you on the 23rd of july 2019 in ireland remember don't forget where you were ladies and gents as i show people this is the app i use all the time and it's like having your very own crystal ball in your hand this is what shows you the temperatures and i try to remind everybody that if you go back a couple of days and watch closely how they manufacture half this weather and then they tell you that the heat is at the spreading up from Africa and just happens to hit Ireland. In fact, you can see that the winds that are coming in from the northwest were bringing the cloud system yesterday in from the northwest. And still, still, that's one of the reasons why we're so cool today. Today should have been, wait for it, 41 degrees now they were spraying from 5 a.m this morning but of course condensation trails they spread out all day and then when all the ordinary people grew up today normal time all they saw was the blanket of clouds and that's been up there for the day with little bursts of heat left right and center so watch the weather today because in dublin the weather forecast is one second 22 degrees 22 degrees updated at 417 okay and that's from our friends the weather channel that tells us all the time so it's come down by 16 degrees because of the clouds and the condensation trails that they've sprayed up in the air so folks listen we're going to leave it there today um just want to let everybody know that oh you can hear that in the background that's the uh, irish air force training for them um, the air show that takes place in bray in bray and uh, you're more than welcome if you're in ireland to head out to it i don't bother going to it because i've got the air show over my house every day when they practice when the sun comes out so in the meantime they'll fly over my house all day and uh, so we have to look at this this is the Air Force, as I keep on telling people. Watch for the storm that's coming this weekend. And uh, I just want to show everybody there's the storm. In the meantime, it's Artificial Ireland. Yours truly, Polly. And don't forget, let's see, can we get 80 views today? 80 views. That's what we're laying for. See ya.